part of the concept that we developed was about um, bringing that, that artistic style and fashion and music onto the pavilion, into the middle of the triangle, and then open it out. Essentially, it's a public platform for people that are normally hidden away in our buildings um, to be given a chance to share the creative process and open up and demystify what goes on when they create something. Although the pavilion, when it's closed up, looks like a very solid box and kind of represents the, the facades of these buildings, um, as it opens up and sprawls out over the site, you then start to see what's going on inside. So I'm Wilf Menel, the um, architectural and environmental designer for um, the pavilion. Hi, I'm Sam Curtis Lindsay, and I'm head of operations at Creative Network Partners, which is Metal House and Hackney Down Studios. Okay, so my name's Jeff Walker. I, I have a company called Refuse. My name is Felix Friedman. I'm an artist, a freelance photographer. Well, my name is Zoe Spiliopoulou, and uh, I'm an architectural assistant in Interurban Studios. My name is Douglas Nicholson and I work with alternative and historic photography processes. I'm Katarina kronberg golivyowska I'm a visual artist, graduated from Slate. My name's John Potter. Um, I have a studio in Space Studios here. Uh, my name is Ryoko Mutasano. I'm, I'm born in Japan and came here um, 11 years ago to study fashion and design and marketing. The pavilion is actually very flexible uh, and things fold and um, things pull out and I think that represents a bit of, of what people do here. It's, it is very flexible, people come and go, um, different artists come and go, different styles come and go and I think um, the pavilion is, is about bringing that to the general public so as you walk by you, you see what's actually inside these quite important buildings in, in East London. So the idea for the pavilion was to create something that was fun, interactive and got people talking about design. I was involved initially in the concept, working together with members of CMP. Creative Network Partners. To kind of work out how we were going to deal with the site, which is quite challenging. Um, it's obviously a triangle, it's got lots of street furniture on it, um, lots of movement, lots of people moving through it, lots of traffic noise. Um, so, so there were the number of challenges we had to deal with. I love the simplicity of it, uh, I, lo I love the fact that it's using a combination of reclaimed and new materials, we can make it, we can make it weatherproof, we can make it solid and we can make it quite unique. So in, in developing the design we um, got in touch with a, a company called Living Furniture. So my involvement in the Living Furniture project is to buy, provide training and skills uh, development for the Living Furniture project people who are mostly homeless or have been homeless really fantastic idea um, helping to bring homeless people um, back into the workplace um, they get great hands-on experience they do fantastic carpentry work and, and having them on board really kind of pushed the design a bit towards reusing materials reclaiming materials um, in a kind of artistic interesting way we hope that the pavilion demystifies the process and the thought behind design and that Hopefully people will be able to connect with it. So working with London Design Festival, Pavilion East is a platform for designers, makers and creatives. We host some of the most talented creatives in the world and this is a public space whereby people get a chance to showcase some of the work that they do. My personal um, work as an artist uh, covers different projects, different series about human being, human behaviour. I'm exhibiting at the pavilion a series I photographed about uh, José. I uh, was very, very fascinated by his idea to squat an island in West London. It's an extreme uh, way of life and I feel very attracted by this. The, 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 yeah, uh, how people make things happen and, and, and with, with everything's possible. Uh, we are a Hackney-based architectural practice. We form the whole part of the practice doing uh, projects all over London, all over the world and uh, in different uh, subjects such as architecture, master planning, urban design and installations. The question whether I'm an artist or a designer, I'm kind of unsure. I like the mix of art, craft and science and on my card it's art, education and research. 
At the moment I'm exploring wet plate photography, which is a process uh, first used in the mid 1800s and it involves sensitising a photography plate, either glass or metal, in silver nitrate, taking the image and developing before the plate dries. And that's about kind of 15 minutes from beginning to end. I'm interested in physical phenomena, space travel and science fiction. So Interstellar Clouds is a work inside a framework called Tracing Universes. Um, so I'm creating 80 individual slides. Um, I'm using foils, um, I cut in unexposed films and project the light through the individual, individual slides. And in front of the projector I'm placing a spectral lens, um, usually, um, to fracture the image. Um, part of my work involves painting on acrylic and playing guitar. I perform my own music, I compose my own music, which frees me to paint on the acrylic. So I paint, I make the painting an event. The, the, the fact that I am um, painting on acrylic, I'm in the throes of making a screen, so it becomes the art object rather than a sacred piece of art that hangs on the wall. Uh, so it, it, it could easily be interpreted as, as design or made into design. Um, so it has that flexibility. Yeah. For this event, um, I like to show um, um, how I make flower accessories, which have been a bestseller of my brand um, over like six years. And people actually can come can pick some fabrics that I prepared and then mix them up and make their own special combination and I can make it for them especially uh, in about four or five minutes in front of them so that's my workshop. The idea is that the pavilion is a platform for the amazing people that are in our buildings and that just word gets out there about some of the brilliant stuff that they're doing. Start singing, shouting, screaming.